is weekend two of our property search and we are off to Holsworthy and Butte today to look at three properties. So the first one is about 30 minutes from where Matt's going to work and the other two are right in the centre of Butte which means he could walk to work. So let's go check out these properties. Okay, we've just pulled up to the first property. Semi-detached. Um, it doesn't look like, oh no, it does look like the estate agents here. All right, let's go have a chat.
So that place is a no. <laughs> it needs so much work. And the main reason is this, this it's road. Me. I'm the main reason. <laughs> not, not Matt, but the road behind him. Since we've been here, there must have been about 30 cars going up and down. Easily. Extremely fast and so loud. Um, and you can't get to the <clears> back <throat> garden, like the, the field, sorry, from this way. You'd have to go down this path to the main shed, which means the cats are gonna not are going to struggle. I think the land, the land, sorry, the, the house itself is a bomb site inside. You could do a lot with that but it's a lot of cost for, versus the cost of the property itself. Um, and like Leah says, the other, the other part of the property down the way with the, with the barn as it is. Um, yeah, it's a barn, cool. But getting there, it's dangerous, probably deadly. So uh, anyway, off to the Butte houses. So we're just trying to find the um, other house and we've managed to drive like around the little street because they, literally on the same street um and we've had to come out drive around to some other streets because it's so narrow and so grown over and nowhere to park um so we've parked in a main street and we're gonna just take a little walk down there now i say little walk i don't know how long the walk is so let's go have a look
we'll talk about that one just in a minute because we're already at the next one, which is here. So let's go have a look. property the really funky one very small um very slopey very slopey there might be a problem get trying to get a mortgage on that place anyway um but yeah it was beautiful beautifully done out um just very very small and then we went to see this cottage which we weren't we actually decided looking at it that we weren't going to get go for it we tried to ring them and say like, we don't want to view it anymore. But the guy turned up and he was like, well, yeah, you might as well have a look. We had a look and it was actually quite nice. <laughs> so, I mean, at the inside- the Inside needs a lot of work. Needs a lot of work and it, it's small. It has a floor with a bubble. Yeah. A very large human sized bubble. Yeah, the floor is not flat at all, but it's got quite a big garden, which is nice. Anyway, that guy said, oh look, I've got this other property that's just been lowered. Do you want to go have a look? So we're off to see a bonus fourth house.
just doing a quick update because my camera actually died after the last property that we saw on Saturday. Um, and we really liked that place. Alexis thinks it's haunted because it's next to a graveyard <laughs> and it is still kind of small. So um, it's really lovely. I just, I really want a bigger garden. So we're keeping it in mind. But we have got another property lined up for next Saturday. Plus we are revisiting the cottage because we really, really like that one. So we're gonna go and have another look, ask a few more questions um, and take it from there.